this is a great representation of lifestyle, <laughs> bringing in these amazing chefs, as well as the awesome tennis players, just really helps our New Yorkers make it here. And City just loves representing these type of events. Cheers. Wellness in the Schools is about giving healthy food to kids and also uh, active recess. So this is like the perfect event for us because we, we have some great food and Jonathan's going to be doing some great demo about healthy cooking. And then we have these tennis players who, you know, they're probably the fittest people in the world. It kind of works perfectly for our program. So I'm preparing succotash, which is it's the old Native American dish that basically they serve at the end of harvest season. Well, allegedly we made a succotash, but I just ate. I already knew going in that I was going to have the skills to really succeed, so my plan was to eat as much as I could, and I think I succeeded. I couldn't flip that thing to save my life, and then when I tried to hold it, it was heavy, and I felt, oh my god, my wrist. I got nervous, and then when I did try, it was like a crash. So I decided to let go and start eating again. City Taste of Tennis is mandatory. This is fantastic. I love it. You get a variety here. It doesn't matter what you're eating. Different styles, different countries, different cultures. Just like the players on the tour, it's all diverse and we're all here to celebrate. Yeah, I mean, it's the first time I've uh, obviously been a part of it. Um, and I heard some great things. So I thought, you know, tonight's the night where I can actually wear other something other than a hoodie. So, you know, I said I'm going to try and look good. And obviously the US Open is, uh, is an exciting time, so I'm looking forward to it. So it's obviously a great event. I think the food is amazing. The interacting with some players, with, uh, you know, it's one, one of the nights that you can just you know, chill out, relax, but also have some fun. This is something that is really relaxing, but also, also great fun. So and I keep enjoying coming back here, and uh, hopefully there's going to be many, many more. It feels great to be here see different stations and different food and the chefs, how they cook and yeah, it's just exciting and really fun. Well, I am just a taste of tennis veteran. It's just so fun because it's like tennis and food, which are like the two greatest things in the world and it's like combined. New York is the greatest city um, and the combination, you know, of a Grand Slam and a city with amazing food, I don't think you can go wrong. When you have an event that has great tennis players and great food and charity all combined, I'm in. The man right here, the famous guy right here is going to teach us how to make some sushi. We are going to have a sushi preparation and plating competition. We just learned how to make a tuna sushi roll. That was fun. I um, actually did it on site yesterday at a private lesson with uh, Chef Morimoto, dominated the competition. And these guys are uh, so good at what they do. We love sushi. Uh, we go to all the restaurants in New York here, and so to learn how to make it is pretty cool. I could not be anywhere else but here. This is a great event. Food, music, a lot of great people, a lot of fun. I love good food. Um, I love getting dressed up, but it's nice just having this event every every slam. It's something to really look forward to. The food's amazing. Everyone loves food here. It's a great culture, a lot of different influences that uh, you know mesh together, so uh, it just has a little bit of everything.